Hi there, welcome back. Coming up on the programme, explosive storylines and spectacular stunts from this man. He's sent us actor David Witts. He's going to be revealing what's next for Jerry Browning. We're not promising you're going to do those kind of things now, are we? No. 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 We're just no, promising it's right. coming up on EastEnders. Just keep best of luck with that. Now, Jerry Browning only arrived on Albert Square four months ago, but in that time he's had a string of flings. And now, in a controversial storyline, I might add, things are hotting up between him and his cousin Laura Lauren. Laurent. <laughs> Lorraine. <laughs> Oh, I'm picking up a slight sense of anger then, Lauren, eh? My best mates hate me because of you. Why would I go over on they? You might be able to play Lucy and Whitney like some sort of mugs, but it's not going to work for me. Why? Almost said Lorraine there. That would be a storyline, wouldn't it? <laughs> Actor David she Witts uh, is with us now. Morning to you, David. Good morning. In such a short time, you've certainly had your fair share of women, haven't you? Yes, yeah, yeah, for the first time um, that's happened really ever for me. Um, yeah, it's been, been good fun. Oh, because yeah. you've kissed Lucy and Whitney. And, yes. And now, we don't actually know yet, but we know really, don't we, that you're going to snog Lauren. Yeah, well, well, the pictures have been released, it's like I'm, yeah. I'm allowed to say that. <laughs> yeah, um, yes. You don't on the show, I haven't seen it yet. You haven't seen no. it yet, I think that happened this week. Um, but... Yeah, that sort of comes out of nowhere, doesn't it? Mm. But um, I, th I think the feelings have been there for both of them since the start. I've, I've said that for a while. But um, uh, they only sort of start to accept them in the next few weeks. Because, of course, Lauren is his cousin. Yes. So that's the controversy, isn't it? Yes. And, and, and yes. I you know, as, as expected, people will... Mm. Will... Um, be shocked. Will be shocked yeah. by that. But, I mean, sort of, for, for me... Um, these are two people that have they've no, only met, you know, age, well, Joey's 25, Lauren's 18, so as adults, so it's, um, I, I personally, the way I've been playing, I don't feel it's been, I, I don't feel it's as um, sort of creepy as, you know, as you it is as at first glance, mm. do you know what I mean? Because you're new to it, and, yeah, yeah. and she's very attractive, obviously, you're a good looking guy, and frankly, you wouldn't want Ian Beale as your father-in-law, would you? So that's why you're, no, you're, not, no. you're not Lucy on the head for that yes, reason. Yes, yes, just for that reason alone, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you are a bit of a rogue. Do you, like, do you like playing that sort of love rat character? Does it um, come naturally? Uh, no. Yes, it does. Look at that. No, no not in the slightest. Oh, you don't think it's new to his standard. Not in the slightest. No, it's been really interesting actually to play sort of against sort of um, type um, mm. with, with with Joey. I, I, I think just by talking to me in these few minutes now, you'll probably be able to realise that I'm nothing like him. Um, but it's been really fun, really good fun to sort of explore that. You got sexiest male at the Inside Soap Awards, though, didn't I you? Know, yes. Um, that doesn't embarrass yeah. you at all, I can tell. No, oh, I, well, I, I sense foul play. Um, oh. <laughs> no, it was, you know, it was really lovely to, to um, sort of receive an award just because it's been voted for by, um, by, by people who watch the show, which is lovely, but um, I, I'm not entirely sure how to react to that. Oh. You know, like, like me, David, it helps that you work out an awful lot. Yes. You know, so, you know, I'm joking. <laughs> yeah. You thought I was serious then, didn't you? I don't know. You that well, yeah. I don't know where we yeah, were going. Absolutely no chance. You work out a hell of a lot more than I, uh, I ever would. <laughs> Is it important, though, do you think, these days, for young lads like yourself to, to look your best, more than it ever um, was, perhaps? I think, I think quite possibly, yeah, yeah, in TV especially. I mean, I've never done it. So It's been a hobby of mine for about four or five years now, um, and that's, that's all it's been. It's not been something that I thought, well, I'm going into TV now, let's start training. It's just, yeah. just you know, everyone's got sort of a hobby, and that's mine. But this is your first TV role. Mm. Big place to start, mm, isn't yeah, it? I mean, definitely. you're clearly quite shy and, and, and <laughs> down to earth about everything. But has it been quite overwhelming suddenly finding yourself recognised? Yeah. And... Well, I mean, mm. I mean, I grew up in a family that sort of never, you know, we sort of watched the soaps in and out, but we were never sort of massive right. fans that followed. So I never. So when I when I joined the show, and obviously it takes a couple of months of filming before I'm on yeah. screen. You know, producers are saying to me, you know, your life's going to change, you're not going to be able to get... And I thought, no, because I thought I wouldn't recognise yeah. anyone from, from a soap, mm -hmm. so why would anyone else? But, so it has come as quite a surprise when people do. Do you know what I think it was oh, written in the stars you. because David at school was nicknamed David Wicks. Yeah, yeah. Wicks, David Wicks. Yeah. 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 yeah, that name did, it plagued me throughout school. What's in a name? Many, many a teacher misspelled my name. Lovely um, to chat to you. Lovely to meet you. Thanks, David.